guys. Good morning, good morning everyone. We are fixing to go into feed at the Elfia, Pennsylvania. Let's see how bad it's gonna be. I suspect it will be quite challenging getting in there. We'll have to see, I guess bad it's going to be. But we got to do our delivery and our appointment is at 8 o'clock and uh, I left here at 6.30 and it's only 25 miles to go which Tell should only uh, take us half an hour to go. Technically I should be there One at 7, 7.15. Seven the right I-476, I-76 is US 202. If there is no traffic, you know, but uh, I suspect there will be a lot of traffic. So I figured I'm not taking any chances. I figured I go in there about 45 minutes to an hour earlier to make sure I get there on time. At least that's a plan. Make sure that I get there on plan. Well, we can't guarantee that just yet, but we'll have to see. Anyways, let's go find out. Here we go, guys. We are starting to get into Philly, Philadelphia. Look at that, the big city right up the head there. We're starting to come closer and closer to the big ahead. river. Left lane. Right to, to the left on I-76. And then yeah. slide left to 850 feet. Where we need to be at, so let's try and get into In position. Slide left on by 676 East US 30 East. Left lane must exit, alright. I'm just hoping we will get to the right location. In 1.5 miles, keep to the left on by 95. By 95, okay. We will do that, we will do that. Just really hoping I can get in and out of there and find the right place and hopefully everything will be alright. I'm really nervous on this one. <laughs> oh man. Anyways, let's go do our thing. Well, here we go guys. That is a river up there, big one there. I'm not sure if that's the Hudson River or not, whatever that is, but it's a big bridge going over top of it. Holy smokes, that bridge looks low on here. <laughs> but it is bigger than what it looks. This is where all the docks are starting here to the left. And we gotta go to one of them docks up there somewhere. We gotta find the right one. Hopefully we can do that. Just really hoping that we will find our way. Columbia Avenue, that's where I got to go to. Yeah. That's right. Because this load is actually going to Columbia. Rolls of plastic. That's what it is. Anyways, let's go see if we can find this place. Well, guys, we have just finished getting unloaded. Now the challenge is trying to find our way out of here. <laughs> we had to go back to 76 and then uh, we'll take that over there to 476 and go towards Hazleton, Pennsylvania. Yeah, it says right here, it says 276, so 95 and 76. So we gotta make our left hand turn here. Yep, that's what we'll be doing. Make a left hand and then go see if we can find the interstate. Just gotta wait for the light, I guess. Oh, there we go. That was pretty quick. Oh, yeah. We got a cop up there with lights. I don't know what he's. Oh, he's looking for that guy. Okay. Yes, he wants to get that guy, so 
and we'll move on. I thought he wanted to cross the highway here, but I guess not. Wanted to get that guy right there. Oh well. well we want to go to the entrance to the right on by 95 North. Construction ahead. I don't want to go east either, so I guess we'll go this way. Oh, there's not another cop. Yeah, lots of cops up here, that's for sure. Here we go. Let's make our zigzag around here and see where the GPS will take us, right? Well, guys, this is I 95 for you. There's a helicopter. Yeah, there's a helicopter above us there. It is a big city up here, that is for sure. We were just down there on the right. That's where we did our delivery. Now we're going to get out of here. And one thing that I have to say that I am extremely surprised of is of the traffic. I thought there would be way more traffic in the morning to get in here. There was not bad traffic at all. And even right now, not bad at all. Nope. Well, we gotta go on to the 676. Everything is 76 up here. <laughs> That's one thing I've noticed. Everything is 76. Gonna get into this lane here because we gotta take the left hand exit up here. But it is uh, beautiful scenery up here, I think. Some high bridges way up there. That's where we went underneath there before. When we came down there. And uh, all kinds of high rising buildings up here. But like I said, I've never been here before. This is my very first time ever coming to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Yeah, total new experience for the both of us. <laughs> now we're in the dark. <laughs> Here we go again. We got light. In a quarter mile, keep to the left on by 676 you US. You seem to have a lot of bridges here. The left in zero yes, point five miles. overpasses, yeah. We gotta make our way into that lane there, buddy. All right, here we go. Cut her across a little bit, four-wheeler. Didn't want to let me get in there. There we are. Oh shit, this, uh, this is the way we gotta go. We gotta go on this side here. We wanna go west. See, this is exactly where we were underneath the fort. Yeah. Yeah. This is a big bridge. That bridge looks lower than it actually is. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. I guess we'll go the same way as we came in. Take your easy up miles. here. Cross straight on by 76 West, US 30 West. Alright, alright. We'll do that. Yahoo! That's what it says up there. See that billboard? Uh -huh. Oh, no, it disappeared. Yeah. <laughs> See the big high rise buildings up there to the left? These are huge. Yeah. You were sleeping before halfway when we come in there. Looks like they made the road a little bit into the uh, earth or something because yeah. 
the way it's constructed designed up the here hair. looks different. But I guess everything is different when you go into a new place. Anyways, we got some good sceneries for you guys and hope you guys will enjoy it. Oh yeah. Little towns of Pennsylvania. That's right. Little, little, tiny towns of Pennsylvania. Places we gotta go as truck drivers, you know? Cutting across this 209 towards Hazleton. So far everything seems to be okay. I know my Ron McNally is pretty good, but uh, get me down roads that are truck legal. So far I haven't seen any signs that trucks aren't allowed to go down here, so... Interesting going into Pennsylvania, that's for sure. You're gonna get all kinds of sceneries, hills, narrow roads, oh, 25 miles an hour, eh? Right. I guess we better slow down. Old buildings, old towns, all kinds of goodies. to go to Hazleton and pick up our uh, preloaded trailer and then we would like to see if we can make it to Toronto tonight I think we should be able to as long as we're gonna keep keep on driving pretty steady we should have no problems making it and if we make it very good chance we'll go to Master State oh, yeah. Very good chance. Yeah, even narrow road here, and then they allow people to park on the shoulder yet. <laughs> oh, well. Anyways, we'll continue rolling down here and see how it goes. Alrighty, guys, we are in another small little town. Let's see. Oh, yeah. We gotta make our turn up here. Let's see, we can do it. Oh yeah, we can do it. No problem, right? Uh, it's gotta be a professional truck driver, right? For 3.2 miles. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that, they got a train up here. Train rides. Yeah, I don't know if they do train rides, but... Yeah, there was a ticket for this train. There was? Okay. I want to walk over here. All right, we'll let him cross. We will let him cross. Oh yeah, we are good people, right? Oh yeah. People want to cross the highway, we let him go across. You don't run him over. <laughs> that wouldn't be good. Where do you no. see a subway in here? You see one? No, it's further, no back. it's further back. Oh, it's further back, I yeah. see. Must be good sceneries down there, right? Eh? Oh, Lots yeah. of people down there. There was a there's a river down there. So. There's a river down there? Oh boy. Okay. Well it was a nine percent incline there. Yeah. Very hilly terrain up here, that's for sure. Looks like they're building another new bridge up there. Yeah. I guess this one is starting to go old. Mm -hmm. I don't want to turn, I want to go straight. There we go. Hey, this is it's fun, fun, fun going down here, right? Yeah. That's what I thought. Hazleton, 15 miles. That's where we want to go. Like, I don't know how they're going to bend it over here. <laughs> they're going to have to do some work on this mountain here to get this highway across here. That's going to cost a lot of money. See that old train down there? Yeah. Yeah. 
See another big truck up here. So it's obviously a truck road. Yep. It's just narrow and tight, but we can get along here. Very high above, that's where we are now. It's a really steep drop off, eh? Yeah, I said that before when we were yeah. off. That's for sure. No, it was straight down. <laughs> I bet you this one is even worse than the one up there in BC that I showed you guys last week. Definitely. I don't know if you can see it there very much, but it goes down. That's for sure. Well, guys, we finished dropping our trailer here in Hazleton, Pennsylvania. And I figured, I found out that. Uh, my load ain't gonna be ready till uh, 8 o'clock tonight, which by that time I'll be out of hours because I started early this morning to make sure I delivered my load on time. I'll be out of my 14 hour window at 7.15 so I can't even pick it up today. So, But that's just down the road from here and uh, what we are doing in the meantime is cooking stew. Yeah, look at that. Figured we have nothing better to do than maybe cooking a stew or something, you know? So we were hungry, we hadn't had breakfast done, so why not cook a stew, right? Yep. Well, guys, we are ready to have ourselves some uh, lunch. Looking pretty good. We got some orange juice, right? Yeah? You ready to eat? Oh, yeah. We're going to have ourselves a good stew, it looks like. So let's get to eating. Well, guys, we got not much left to do other than finish this today video and go to bed. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. That's what I figured. Didn't do a whole lot today. Basically only drove from Philadelphia up to here to Hazleton, which only, I think, was only like 100 miles, or so just over 100 miles. Which isn't much. No, which is not a whole lot at all. So, we didn't do a whole lot at all. Like I said, we uh, we went over here to the Hazleton uh, place up here. And uh, the load wasn't ready, and it wasn't going to be ready till 8 tonight. Well, since I started early this morning... I couldn't uh, I couldn't go there at 8 o'clock and pick up the load because uh, of my 14 hour window on the clock you know so uh, dispatch said well they do have two loads there and he said well go check on the other one see maybe the other one is going to be ready earlier and so we went and did that and uh, no luck there either so uh, so here we are still at the truck stop getting ready to go to bed right yeah starting to get lazy and tired over here and yeah it didn't do much today it was pretty boring no we cooked ourselves some stew and yeah that was fun yeah we had a good lunch and yeah then we took ourselves i took a little bit of an afternoon nap he didn't he was listening to some podcasts right podcasts a yeah. whole bunch of car technology and a whole bunch of other stuff yeah, so he was listening to all kinds of stuff there. Oh, it took me a little afternoon nap, and here we are at the end of the day. And I tickled him under his nose with stuff <laughs> that would tickle him. But yeah, he was bugging me. <laughs> well, I guess he's got nothing better to do, right? So, I mean, it's good, uh, good having him along here coming on the trip. I enjoy it very much. Oh, yeah. It's better than being home. But yeah. not all the time. Not. Gotta be home once in a while. Yeah, but well, we did have a lot of fun though. I mean, but here we are. Fixing to go to bed, so uh, gotta close the show and uh, say goodbye to you guys. And so with that, we will uh, cut it here for now. And But we will have a video up again tomorrow. So, uh, if you are new to this channel and you're just checking me out or whatever, we would love to have you subscribe to our channel. We would very much appreciate that. And for those of you that uh, are 
loyal subscribers or are subscribed to my channel hey leave me a comment on there below on what you think of today's vlog and uh, maybe you have some ideas on what we can uh, film and stuff like that and, and uh, hey you never know maybe uh, you might be running into us somewhere down here on the road and we will uh, try and feature you on our on our vlog you know if you want a shout out just put your name in the comments below yeah if you want a shout out just put the name in the comments and we will uh, maybe even he will do the shout out you know if you want a shout out from him right yeah he will do a shout out for I, you. I did last time we were checking with you but I got no one to shout out to so yeah uh, we made a little weather report type slash update video there the other day and I guess uh, not everybody caught on to it yet I guess <laughs> that he's come along with me on a trip but uh, anyways have a good night everyone and we will see you tomorrow it's time to get going it's time to move on put this behind me that day is gonna come I'm breaking the wall